Well, um, did anybody tell you what you're here for today? Okay. So let me let me just start by talking. We're not going to ask you anything until when we say some things first, okay? Um, we're here because we are looking into the murder of Carla Walker. And we've done a very thorough investigation. We know what happened, and our evidence has led us to you, okay? There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. I know you're confused, but you shouldn't be because we know what happened, okay? Now, this is your opportunity to talk to us, to tell us your side, because I have, I have bosses that I have to answer to, and what they want to know is that if you have any regret, if there's, if there's anything that you can tell us that doesn't paint a picture of you that makes you look like a monster, because frankly, right now, when you're talking about a young girl that got murdered, we only have one side, and we'd like to hear yours, okay? So that's, that's why we're here today. Okay. We don't. We know what happened, but we'd like to hear from you if there's anything. We, hold on. Hold on. Okay. All right. But before we go any further, though, okay, I gotta read something to you, just like in the movies. You have the right to remain silent in any and any and not make any statement at all. And any statement you make may be used against you at your trial. Any statement you make may be used as evidence against you in court. You have the right to have a lawyer present to advise you prior to and during any questioning. If you are unable to employ a lawyer, you have the right to have a lawyer appointed to advise you prior to and during any questioning. You have the right to terminate the interview at any time. Okay. Now, do you understand these rights as I've read them to you? Yes. I mean, is there any question that you have? Do you know what the word terminate means? To get rid of it. To, to end. Okay. So basically, I'm asking you if you're willing to waive your rights and talk about what we just discussed, or uh, it's up to you. You know, you, you can either talk to me or not, but we'd really like to talk to you today. Then I did something to that girl? Yes, sir. I don't think so. You don't think so, what? That I did. I, I don't know. I've never seen the girl or anything. Okay. When was I supposed to have done that? Okay. So are you willing to talk to me today? About this case? Um, I mean, I so tried. The other day when you came. Okay. But are you willing to talk to us today? I mean, it's like I said, it's your right to either speak with us or not. You know, but I got to be clear on whether or not you're willing to talk. Well, to I don't us. know. I don't, I don't know anything about this stuff. Okay. Well, the other day I was talking to you. Mm -hmm. And uh, I involved me in this little girl here, I guess, I, I, it really is not an involvement, but it, I had a, a, a 22 pistol okay. that had it, it was a clip in it. Mm -hmm. Well, I was fishing it over on the, just south of me, over there on the, the river. Mm -hmm. Long, been a long time ago. I don't even remember what the date was. And, uh, I heard some exhaust pipe, I mean some tires going on the pavement and everything and I, I, I quit and come over by my pickup and everything and I had that gun that I had. Just one really just a second. Do you have the radio? Mm-hmm. Keep inside. Okay. You just run his rights. Well, he's, he's, it's already recorded. We don't need to talk. But oh. are you clear about your rights, though, to move forward and to discuss this case? Do you want to talk about this? Well, all I can tell you is just that uh, that's what that, the, the whole thing was over that I understood. Mr. Yes. Markerly, can you look at that picture and just tell us for sure that you do not know who she is? You've not had any contact with her? I've never seen her before. I don't know who she is. If you stand right beside of me, you say it's what? What's your name? Carla Walker. So you've never met her before, never seen her. I've never seen her, never met her, uh -huh. never talked to her. I wouldn't know her uh -huh. if she was standing beside of me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But then I'm not. I guess it's not any. Uh, importance anymore, but those, there was two guys in pickup and they, 
I went to check, I had that pistol in under the seat wrapped up in a cloth. And uh, I didn't think anything about it, and everything looked all right. And then later on, I found out that they had stolen that pistol. Mm -hmm. And I told the uh, police that came to talk to it at the time that I didn't have the pistol that had been stolen. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see. One of, uh, they took me downtown and questioned me and all this and that. And I told them exactly what I'm telling you and everything and what happened. And uh, they said that they had found a clip mm -hmm. uh, for a 22 pistol. And uh, I didn't know anything about it. And they thought that gun might have been used in the, in, the, in the robbery or something. So they found it and... and Real quick, she did read you your rights. Just want to make sure that you understood them and that you're willing to waive your rights. We're not saying you did anything. We just want to make sure that you understood those and you're waiving your rights and willing to talk well, to I us. I don't understand any of that. Um, it just basically means that you're willing to talk to us today. Either either you're willing to or you're not, which I think you are, but we just need to be clear on that, okay? So basically, if, if we talk today, then it's because you want to, not because you have to. You don't have to talk to us, but we would like to talk to you. But if, well, I, I don't even know when this girl was done that way or I don't know anything but before we get into that we need to know that you understand what detective Wagner read to you and that you're waiving those rights and are willing to talk to well I, how did that's what I'm trying to get to is how how you and that other guy well in order for us to discuss this case you have to be able to you're gonna have to waive your rights to talk to us about it Otherwise, if you don't waive your rights, we've got to stop the case, okay? So it's one or the other. We can talk about it and move forward, which requires you waiving your rights, or we stop. But it's, it's one or the other. So we'd love to talk to you, but again, it's, it's, it's up to you whether or not you want to move further. Do you understand that? that? That's why we said terminate. If, you, if you're not comfortable talking, you can stop the interview. Do you agree to talk to us today, Mr. McCurley? I agree. I would agree to talk because I haven't done anything. Okay. okay. But uh, still, it. So you're agreeing to talk to us? I, don't I agreed to talk to you the other night, mm -hmm. and I told you about my gun, mm -hmm. and you you told me that you were putting me on the suspect of doing something. Just for losing a clip and a gun, because I went down to the store and bought bought another one to replace it. And they came and come and talked to me and asked me if why I bought another clip. I said, Well, I bought another clip. I ran into a good price on one, mm -hmm. and I put I I was going to buy another gun, another pistol like that because it been stuck. I didn't have one, and that's. That's as far as I'm into the whole thing. Okay. I mean, it, it, and you turned it around the other way. I'm not, I mean, that's your job. We're yeah. not trying to confuse you. We're just, we would like to talk about this case with you today, but we need to know that you're okay with talking about it. Well, I just, I don't know the girl. I've never seen her. So do you want to discuss? I haven't. I haven't killed anybody like I told you the other day. Mm -hmm. I'm 77 years old, and I, I'm not into that kind of stuff. Well, if you'd like to know more details, we just need to know simply if, if you would be willing to talk about this. Well, I don't see how you could have anything on me because I don't have. I don't know anything about it. Right. You want a drink or something like that? Oh, thank you. Are you sure? Yes.